Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. If you enjoy these videos, please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. It lets me know that you like these videos and you want to see more, so. So I've had this idea in my head for a while, um, but I just wasn't sure how I wanted to execute it. As I started developing it more and thinking about it more, I'm gonna go ahead and stop myself. So I'm currently at my desk editing this video and I am watching these clips and listening to my explanation and um, mm, yeah, no, they don't make any sense. So let's try again shall we oftentimes when i've told people that i'm an artist or that i studied art uh, they're pretty quick to express their disapproval um, often get negative comments or there's no career in art there's no future in photography i've heard this from distant relatives friends and people i literally just met i've chosen to be confident in myself and to embrace the process and to really um, work hard to make this my career path and uh, make sure that I feel fulfilled in my career. But with that being said, there's always going to be those negative comments, whether your career choice or your life choices are art related or not. So for this week's video, I really wanted to create an image that for me represents those struggles and also those successes and really embracing um, my passions and my and my ambitions so we're going to start off talking about inspiration and symbolism so the inspiration for the shoot actually came from the phrase hold your breath and i just started thinking about the term or the phrase and instead of thinking about it figuratively, I kind of started thinking about it literally. So for the term, hold your breath. According to Oxford languages, the literal definition is to cease breathing temporarily or to be in a state of suspense or anticipation. Now the informal meaning is used to tell someone not to expect something for a very long time. So now let's talk about the symbolism of balloons. Balloons represent freedom and independence, weightlessness, ascension or floating towards a never-ending sky and they're also used for celebrations and milestones for this shoot i wanted to use a balloon as a vessel used to capture control air itself now let's talk about the color red now the color red represents passion courage power and love but on the negative side it also represents fear and stress and now for the color yellow it represents happiness creativity and optimism this shirt from Target. I paid probably six dollars for it because I'm cheap and I got it off the clearance rack. So um, anyways, this is what I ended up wearing for my photos. Very simple. So when it comes to props, I used balloons from the dollar store. Surprise, surprise. If you've seen my videos before, you know I love me some Dollar Tree. Um, so this is a packet of 14 latex balloons for $1. Um, I just used the red um, balloons. I think there's probably like three in here, but one did the job, so that's it. As for the lighting setup, I have my white backdrop, as you can see here. Um, I just put that and set it as high as I could because for these images, I decided to stand. Um, I have my two soft boxes on each side of me per usual. I also put them up high so they're kind of pointing down. Hopefully you can see my hands pointing down. Um, and then yes, I have my tripod in the middle with my uh, camera and use my remote. I finally have one and just shot that way.
So for these images, I just used one balloon and I tried different poses. I put my remote timer for 10 seconds and then I was able to hide my remote pose and just do a variety. Afterwards, I just took some shots of the balloon by itself so I can composite it into my final image. Conclusion, I really liked how the pictures turned out. Uh, the photo shoot was really fun to do and to create, and the editing wasn't difficult at all. I was, luckily, I was able to shoot and edit everything in one day, which never happens. A lot of times we have so many goals and it can become overwhelming, and sometimes all it takes is just to pick one and start. Our goals are not as far as they seem, but sometimes it can be scary just to, to start and to figure out how to get to that point. Celebrate your successes, no matter how big or small. Embrace them and treat them well. Be nice to yourself and be nice to others and don't go around telling people that they can't do things. I've heard plenty of that already, especially by strangers like, excuse me? Because with a little imagination and a little creativity, you can create whatever you want. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye. Just kind of interpreting it more literally than figuratively, than figuratively. Don't let anyone burst your bubble. <laughs> like Mona Lisa. I added these little, these bad boys to my collection. Neutral, matches with anything and everything. <laughs> Let you know